first up Troy, congratulations on the win today. First Superbike win, great result. Yeah, it was really good Alex, I'm just really, really happy. Um, you know, tomorrow's the day we want to be winning, but you know, to get my first Superbike races in Australia is something I've obviously won for a while and um, now that we've, we've ticked that box I'm, I'm hopefully ready to you know, make that jump from just behind that front group to tomorrow maybe challenging for the championship. You started off on the right foot on Friday, had one of your best Fridays that you've had so far, carried that form into Saturday and yeah, out there all day you looked pretty comfortable. Yeah, for sure. We, I have struggled, like most of the first two rounds I struggled on the Fridays, which put me up behind the eight ball all weekend, and I sort of felt like on Sunday afternoon, if we had that Monday racing, I'd be fine. And so it was really good this weekend to start off strong and um, go with the times and um, set the pace, get my first race win. And um, like now I can, I can start tomorrow, I've got no change with the bike, lock some tyres in and let's go racing. Now you had a full year off last year, how would you compare your feeling on the bike now, you know, compared to 2012 when you were, yep. you know, had some momentum on your side, how would you rate, you know, your feeling now versus back then? Yeah, well, in 2012 I felt like, like in Germany, I felt like I was riding good, I, I, I feel like I was getting the most out of the bike and, um, you know, it wasn't because of my riding um, I didn't go back, I just, um, just needed to freshen up and um, for sure, from when I rode in Australia in 2011 until today, um, I'm, I'm a much more complete rider now. I, I could definitely go fast, go with the guys. I couldn't really um, set the pace and lead the races, whereas now I feel comfortable with the lap times I'm doing. And, and I just said to, to my girlfriend today, like I feel like I'm riding like I should ride today, um, and I feel like I'm comfortable with being in the front, whereas up until today, the first two rounds I'm sort of just creeping on the back of them and I couldn't quite get there, so that's a big bonus. And a big opportunity right around the corner, heading over to Suzuka for the eight hour, you must be really excited about that. Yeah, it was such a big surprise, I, I didn't actually get a, an official confirmation. Um, my friend Josh Waters was um, surfing the internet uh, in England and uh, he sent me an email to say yeah, it would be great to catch up in Suzuka. Uh, I said, well, what, what, do you, what do you mean? And he says, just, I've just read you riding, riding Suzuka with um, Honda Dream Race Team with Jamie Stouffer, um, who are my teammates, so it's going to make it really good. It's obviously something you dream of doing. It's not an opportunity I'm going to pass up. And um, I head over on Monday night. Um, we've got uh, four days in testing in total. And, um, yeah, just really excited to get out on that track and, and ride with some of the best riders in the world. Definitely awesome news. Well, best of luck for tomorrow and for the testing at Suzuka. Yeah, thanks, Alex.